TitleMatchNetwork.com. Julie Cutler here with the Title Match Network, coming to you from the legendary 2300 Arena in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And I am being joined by the original bro himself. King of bros. That, that, that's my, that's my uh, government or, you know. Your this, legal name. Yeah, that's their name. Okay. I'm, the, I'm the king of bros again, Matthew Riddle. Or sometimes I'm a rude dude. You know, let's not go there. But you got some questions for me. Let's do this. Yes, I do. So the king of bros, you have been all over the place these past several months, taking winning titles, taking every single promotion by storm. What has been the highlight of Mania Week this year for you thus far? Highlight of Mania Week. Well, I think the highlight for me every year at Mania season isn't so much the or the people or the matches those are all good but it's the people I haven't seen in months or maybe a year I got friends from England I got friends from Germany I got friends from all over the United States and Wrestlemania brings us all together so that's probably my favorite part of all the events and everything that are taking place this weekend and Speaking of WrestleMania, it's been a big week, 40th WrestleMania. Is there any particular WrestleMania moment that maybe you watched growing up that stands out to you, that inspired you as a performer? Child, childhood dream, Shawn Michaels. I was a little kid. The dude won it, won the Rumble, beat Brett. Sick. Sick. In inspirational, I would say. So that, that's the, my memorable moment, you know? And last but not least... I know we've mentioned we've seen you competing in a lot of different promotions since your debut on the independent scene, taking the pro wrestling world by storm. Is there any promotion or anybody that maybe you haven't stepped toe to toe with yet that you'd like to use this opportunity to put on notice? Uh, maybe, I don't know. I don't like, usually people call me out. I just talk a lot of trash and people get upset about it. Uh, but I'm willing to work anywhere. But I'll say this, this is the first time in my life where I'm a free agent. Since like I was 20, I was either signed to the UFC, signed to Bellator, signed to Titan FC, signed to Evolve, signed to WWE. And now I'm not signed to anybody. People are trying to sign me. I'm just like, no, thank you. You know, and I'll work wherever I want to work. I get to feel it out. And I feel like people think signing a contract's a good thing, but when you sign a contract, you basically just limit yourself from where you can go work. So I don't see the benefit of really signing a contract. So I'm going to work as a free agent for an extended period of time unless somebody offers me a substantial amount of money to sign with them, which I don't think that will happen. Not yet. So... Well, I will say we love to see the king of bros putting people on notice, winning championships, wrestling all over the nation and all over the world, really. To be fair, I'll probably end up at, you know, the TNAs, maybe the AEWs. I'm already in New Japan. MLW's my second home, you know. I love them. They hook me up. They pay me well, and they give me great opportunities. So, okay. you know, but I'm down to go anywhere, hurt anybody, win money, whatever, dude. Planting some seeds. You never know where you might see the King of Rose pop up next. I don't know. I, don't know. I, I didn't even know what I was doing today. Well, with that being said, this is Julie Cutler for the Title Match Network signing off. Be sure to subscribe for more content like this. TitleMatchNetwork.com.